Hello Lola's, welcome back to my channel guys. Guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel, go ahead and take the time to smash that red subscribe button. Click the red subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And guys, please don't forget to drop down in the description bar if you don't see a join now button and join the Chatterbox. The Chatterbox is exclusive live streams with me and some of your other dolly friends. Um, but of course me. <laughs> um, and it is a dollar and ninety nine cents to join per month. Um, that fee is totally handled by YouTube, and so that's how that works. So I don't see any of your credit card information, and some people do it strictly through PayPal. Anyway, with that being said, um, I wanted to go back and show you guys Baby Cody. Of course, I'm going to get him dressed, although he's not warning disclosure he is not fully together because he is still being rooted but the pre-orders is coming close to ending so if you haven't got your kit go ahead and get your kit um again it is cody by laura to the rust and i do want to tell you guys some of you guys might be like oh it's christmas time i don't have no money for pre-orders I was like really surprised because I hadn't did pre-orders in so long um but I sh and I know I should have done this before I said so I think that is always good when you can definitely go and buy directly from the artist the sculptor themselves the kids um because then they get full money of their <laughs> of of their hard work and I definitely believe you know like sculptors that really sculpt like Lord Tuzeras definitely deserve that. However, it doesn't matter. Um if you have a preferred dealer, that is good. Um a dealer that I usually use is Matt Pearson. And because I had already was ordering some other stuff, I went ahead. That's who I pre-ordered through. But I was really um happy that they actually had a where you can you can pre-order as low as ten dollars or a dollar i think they had a special a dollar at one point i don't know but i mean so then when the kit comes in which will be hopefully we're expecting around january sometime um they will invoice you for the balance of the kit the total price of the kit which i think is phenomenal for this size baby is 115 dollars and that's that's not bad at all because Kits this size, as you guys know, are like easily, you know, 139, 159, 179, like that. So, yeah, so I think the pricing on this baby is really good too on the kit. Um, then, if you don't know who's going to reborn it, it's always good to go ahead and get it and worry about that later. I tell people that all the time because it's like, I don't know who I was going to reborn and now I didn't get it and, and, and now it's sold out and da 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 da. And you know how people do with the sold out kits. You know how us collectors do. We don't play about them sold out kids. We be doubling the price on you. So if you don't get it now, you know, later, you probably will pay $200, $300. Depends on how popular this kid gets. But anyway, nevertheless, oh, I just love his, his, his skin complexion and the painting on this baby. Sorry, I'm, I'm tooting my own horn for a second. I usually don't do that, but I, I'm just kind of admiring him. I, I guess it's really good that he's not fully together yet because I really get to admire him. So let me go over a couple things for you guys. Um, and I'll talk about more later when he gets fully put together. But I just want to tell you guys that this is the body that Laura suggests on her website. And that's another reason why I like that you when you order from you know her. Um, you can order the body. It's the same body that you can use for Love Buggy. For those that have Love Buggy by Laura Tudor Ross. Um, so that gives you an idea that this baby is in that same size. Size um, Thighs are very, very fat though. You have to push it in the body. Um, but it fits and I love it. And I love that um, the body just flows so naturally with him. So I tried another body and I, I didn't like the fit. Um, this is the perfect fit. So, um, of course, for me personally, I'm having one custom made to be just like this body, but in my dose weight color. And I'll show that guys to you later. I have a 
new person doing my body for me. Um, so I'm, I'm excited about that. I'll share the information when I when everything is all said and done. But yeah, so anyway, I do have his limbs weighted now. And so I like because now like because it has a weight, it kind of pressed down and he lays like really naturally like his little legs closed because he has weight in him. So, oh my gosh, it's such a difference when these babies are weighted and his feet. Oh, his feet is so cute. Little fat feet. So anyway, I'm just going to put him in a diaper and a onesie because I don't want to cover him up. Um, his hands, he has one pretty much open hand. And then, and keep in mind, he's on strings, guys. So he's not on zip ties. So if his arms come off, it's because I didn't do a good job on the zip ties. But, and like I said, he is weighted. And then he has a fist on one hand. And I think it is, it's just really adorable. And I love that the kit is actually fat all over. Like, it's a fat, you know. And I maybe I shouldn't use fat, but you know what I mean. Baby fat is cute. Um, it's, it's chubby all the way over. So I like that. I love that he has... Little chubby arms, little chubby hands, chubby feet. You know, he's just a chubby baby. And I just love it. Um, I love him so much that I'm most likely going to keep the prototype. Although i seen the prototype sell for over $4,000. And I know I could probably make good money off of him. But I really love the sculpt. And it's really why I wanted to do the prototype. Because I wanted it for myself. I never tie these. I should tie these. Yeah, I really, I wanted the sculpt for myself. <laughs> That's why I wanted to do it. Um, I was so in love, love with it. But, you know, sometimes after you paint and stuff, you be like, mm, it's okay. And you be okay to let it go. For me, I just can't let it go. You know, it's my first, you know, big prototype and I just I'm just very sentimental like that you know it wears off sometimes you guys know that I'll be on here talking about oh I love this baby oh it means so much to me and then it's like it's for sale I think the only baby that I have really never thought about selling so far and I don't even know how long it's been well it's been almost it's been quite a bit of time because it's been since like April so yeah so almost we we working up on a year for my um Lily Grace and I haven't I haven't um even thought about not one time selling her like not even close like I don't even consider her as a baby in my collection when it comes to that kind of stuff so and I think he could wear size three and four diapers <laughs> yeah he's a chunk and so yeah but I, lo I love I just love him like I love the way he falls and stuff like I can literally just hold the the baby without the head I'm just like oh my gosh so I know I'm just gonna love him when he get back so he is getting a head for the curls and so when he come Y'all know I'm going to be rushing to show y'all him with his hair. But I even thought he was cute, bald. But he's so big, he needs hair. So, um, But for those people that like bald babies, less maintenance, like painted hair, um, he does, with his hair head being the sh shape that it is and everything, he will look good with painted hair as well. Um, but yeah, he, he to me... Um, and I, and I say this and not to discourage people because, you know, here's the thing with this community. The thing is, is that we do what we want to do and how we want to do. But in person, to me, I think Laura really captured the chunky baby look. Like he, I know a lot of people kind of present them more older, as an older baby, more older toddler. And, um, and I thought that was cute too, because he is big enough to go there. So that's another thing. The kid is very versatile. Um, of what your preference is and what you want. But you guys know I'm usually a newborn baby collector. I love baby babies. And so um, I was really happy that he actually 
still look baby and he, even though he's big he just looked like a chubby baby and um so i really i really love that about him and so i think he he looks very baby he just looked like a little fat baby um so with that being said my baby will be still very baby maybe i will say he's you know six you know six six months or something like that um my mom saw him and she was like oh my gosh she was like you were so big like that like i was a big chunky baby she said she had to buy my clothes like special from sears she couldn't just buy me any clothes out of the regular store she said it was so expensive and she was a young mom so she said it was a lot, but she had to, you know, buy my pants and stuff, you know, from Sears because they was the only ones that like chubbies or whatever, something like that at the time. But yeah, you know, that was over 40 years ago, but we ain't gonna talk about that. Oh man. And blue is gonna be his color. This powdered blue look is gonna be his color. Oh my goodness. I just wanna like just pick him up <laughs> and so I love his body kind of like it's got like you know the little push but I made him with some weight in his bum bum and you know a little weight support in his back and stuff like that and then I weighted his limbs so when his other body come I'll just transfer it over the same way or if his head come first then I'll just put his head on weight his head and everything and then put it on and then he'll be good once I I'll put well once I give him this magnet. But yeah, so yeah guys, the pre-orders end on Friday. So if I were you, like I said, just hop over there to, you know, McPherson and Irresistible, um, Laura Tudor Ross website, you know, and um get your kit. I may try to see if I can drop the links to all those different sites in the um, description bar for you guys. So if you look down in the description bar, there will be a link for these different websites where you can order the, order your kit. Um, because I don't want you guys to miss out. And I think this baby really deserves, you know, hands down, you know, every every penny of, of the money. So I, I think and I and I think all the the prototype artists did really nice. It was really nice to see all the different versions of them, you know. Um I love the rainbow. I love, you know, that it was Caucasian, it was um, you know, the the black, the biracial, you know, that type thing. You got you had and you had different looks. You had a semi baby, baby baby, almost uh, mid toddler you know it was it, it just gave you a lot to really kind of give yourself an idea especially as an artist like you're like oh because even I looked at some of them and was like I can't wait to paint my second one because I want a girl that's you know in a chocolate color and I'm like oh yeah she looks good as a girl because you know it was we was able to see them as a girl too so the kit is very like I said very versatile and I, I I'm sorry that I don't have the the head to show you guys again but if you refer back to the videos which i will put a card in the end that you can click on and go back you will be able to see um you know him his face and as you know and see what he looks like as a whole because i definitely think the face although the body is really nice and the limbs is very nice i do think the face is like really the best part but i do think for me, limbs is very important, hands and feet and all that stuff. And I, if the legs and the limbs aren't good, I usually can't, I can't deal. Eventually I end up getting rid of it. So, um, I was really pleased that this one, you know, didn't disappoint, which, you know, like I said, Laura Sculpton usually don't. Um, but yeah, anyway, I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching show you guys his little legs a little bit up close
that's his little legs um and i will see you guys later don't forget to give this video a thumbs up on your way out bye